What's up, everyone? So, um, I, you know, I finally decided... Oh, okay. I finally decided that it would be a phenomenal idea to upgrade my computer again. So, ta-da, I got this. I got a, an RX 7600, or 6700, I cannot fucking speak. So uh, first, I need to actually, actually first, I need to get a place to put this. Uh, oh, here we go, this might work. Uh, good enough, I think. Yeah, okay, let me actually grab some scissors. Got some scissors, uh, I cannot, I don't even know if you can see this, but can you see me? I think, that, you know what? I think this is a good place. Let's get unboxing. Actually, I don't even know if I need scissors. I can just kind of, oh, this is about to be, look at this biggest reveal ever, biggest graphics card reveal. All right, look at this. Just gonna kind of take off this part. All right, now I don't really need this anything and this anymore, so I'll just go over there. But look at this. This is gonna be like the biggest fucking unboxing reveal of the damn century, man. Oh, does this, oh, oh. Wait, what the fuck did I? <gasps> Yo, look at this. Look at this. Okay, this I don't care about. Look at this fucking card, man. Okay, let's take this out of the box. Ah. Holy shit! Look at this, and this costs me 300 bucks. All right, shit, uh, he was to put this. You know what, this is the box. I don't... Well, that's the box, I don't care about the box. So step one, this box, you can go over here. Step two, fucking look at this. It's awesome. Okay, hold up, I'm gonna do what I did last time with one of these things and get like a journal stack, cause I have a bunch of them. Uh, oh, <laughs> you know what? Yeah, we can put it in between the microphone. Actually, that works really well. Okay, we'll do this then. Anyways, so uh, I need to get some sitters, which I actually don't know why the fuck I put them back, but got some sitters. It's very awesome. Anyways, this thing has a whopping 10 gigs of VRAM. Oh, I think it's 10 fucking gigs of VRAM, by the way. That's just awesome as hell. Like, bro, this is amazing. Like, here, I made sure to get the triple fan one because I just like it like that. All right. Okay, I don't need that anymore. Like, fucking look at this. It's fucking awesome, man. Like, this is, in this is insane. This is cool as hell. All right. Now, how the hell do I get this next part? Oh, I've been getting something. Shit. I hate the plastic film on this thing though. The plastic film thing sucks. Okay, again though, why do they use literally the, no look, but like why do they use like the most insane plastic ever? But seriously, this is cool as all fuck man, right here. And look, it's a proper fucking back play. Oh my God. Like, let's go. Oh, there's more plastic shit on here. There we go. Oh, that came out pretty easily. Look. Look at that. It's, there we go. Stupid plastic on the back plate's off. But this is cool as fuck. All right, anyways, I'm gonna go put, anyways, uh, now that I've actually unboxed the card, actually, this is the wrong way. Now that I've, I've unboxed the card, I'm gonna go and benchmark it. Cause why not? I might as well actually see how good this thing is. Oh yeah, the biggest part, the biggest pain in the ass in putting a new card in is always like getting the screws and shit, like honestly. All right, y'all, I literally had to go and find the fucking power connectors. I had to literally find the goddamn power connectors for this thing. Just to pull, just like, look, I finally got them. They're over here. But finally, I can make some progress on installing this thing. So, uh, yeah, I have to go get all the screws. And by that, I mean three of them because I managed to lose one. But, you know, certainly better than nothing. Which, by the way, these are all the screws I unscrewed. Not just to get, not to actually get the here because two of them for PKI PCI slot. And one is for, like, this thing. But so the fact that it took me that long is kind of sad. So I only realized after getting this that, uh, 
you know, uh, this kind of has these fancy things called power connectors <laughs> that I gotta plug into it. So let me go and do that and actually make sure this works properly. And there we go, we finally did it. So you know, now I gotta plug all of this cable gore in and I can finally test out if my investment was worth it. <laughs> oh my fucking God, I finally got it. It works. Yeah. All right, I'm finally installing the drivers. Because this is what happened. This is, you know, this is what I get for switching to AMD this time. <laughs> this is going to take a bit. All right, so for the first benchmark test, this literally took forever to get set up. Anyways, perfect. Going to be doing this one. Yeah, so we're just going to do run. I don't know what else. All right, it's loading. It's being epic and awesome and bullshit like that, I, I guess. And benchmark. All right, now I'm just gonna fast forward through this as it's happening now. Also, what the fuck is that? 200. F that is 200 FPS. That is fucking ridiculous. Fucking finally, this thing is almost done! God damn, you know, this is taking quite literally forever. But anyways, look at that. Look at that absolutely baller, like, frame rate, though. 198! That's insane. That's ridiculous. Holy shit! <laughs> Let's go. 5,000! Dude, and I thought my 1,300, my, like, my 1,650 was impressive. That's fucking insane. What the hell is that maximum FPS? <laughs> Anyways, now it's time to do the second benchmark, which is going to be much more painful on the GPU, but I don't really care. All right, now it's time for benchmark number two. We're just going to do standard everything. I don't really know what the hell all this is. But, uh, yeah, I expect, th I expect this to be very, very awesome and stuff. I expect it to not kill itself. All right, let's see just how high my FPS gets with this one. Also, uh, 10,000 megabytes of memory. That's a lot of memory. Like, goddamn. Please load. If you would load, that would be awesome and phenomenal. Please thank you. Here, all right, here we go. You know, I remember my 1030 couldn't even render half of this thing. Like, OJ, I remember my 1030, I was getting a whopping, like, 5 FPS. Like, look at the FPS, man. Look at that. That's... What is that? We're looking at 127? That's a fuck ton. That's almost my monitor's refresh rate, which is awesome. All right, what the hell? Holy shit! What the fuck? That's 15.5 thousand! What the actual fuck? Bro, I was expecting maybe like eight or nine. This is insane. I think once I got, I think I was with my sixteen fifty. I only got like three or four thousand. This is ridiculous. Holy shit! That is insane. That that is awesome. All right, this is the third benchmark. It is the Roblox benchmark, the Roblox benchmark. So as you can see, we're getting about one hundred and like two hundred FPS, one thirty, one forty. But also the app sucks and is completely unoptimized as shit because with my 1650 I got four or like I got 400 here. But I still think this is pretty good. And here let's go teleport. Uh, here let's go teleport out to here and close the teleport menu. We're getting about 120, 130, and with this we get about 100 FPS. Which honestly, considering how unoptimized this app is, I I guess I'll take that. Of course, you can't forget. The ultimate test. This is like the most ultimate benchmark test you've ever seen. It is the Minecraft benchmark test, which is just something I completely made up out of my head, but who cares? So anyways, first off, this thing. Okay, so this is with shaders. I get about 25-ish FPS, which kind of sucks, actually. I have, you know what? Let's try, let's try without shaders. Uh, shader packs, nope. Do not like shaders. And I get about 
60, 70 FPS. That's actually lower than I expected. What? Oh, wait, this is... Oh, wait, this is with 20. Okay, never mind, actually. Now, let's go into the end and see how that happens. And see how that fares with this test. So, alright. So we get about 85, 86 FPS with shaders. That's pretty good, actually. Honestly, that's a little bit better than I was expecting. But now... Let's disable shader packs, and we get about 200 FPS. You know what? Sure, I'll take that. That's actually pretty good. Though it isn't like the, though it isn't what I got with my 1650. But you know what? Oh well. I think it's still fairly good. At least it's more consistent. But uh, anyways, yeah, that was uh, all of the benchmarks. So, uh, yeah, that was my little GPU unboxing video. I hope you guys liked it somehow. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, that... Also, installing this GPU is a massive pain in the ass. Like, I just didn't expect it to be as much of a pain in the ass as it was. But, yeah, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, you can like, like it, I guess. But, yeah, that's really all I have to say. So, uh, yeah, goodbye.